Hi, I want to introduce you to my scripture memory system and how I go about the discipline of memorizing His Word. Isaiah 55, 10 and 11 says, For as the rain and snow come down from the heavens, but do not return there, but water the earth, making it bring forth and sprout, giving seed to the sower and bread to the eater, so shall it be with my word that goes forth from my mouth. It will not return void, but it shall accomplish that which I sent it and succeed in the very purpose in which I have for it. His word does not return void. And believing that, this is how I have set up my scripture memory system. I take a 4 by 6 index card uh, file box. And then I take the A to Z card guides that you can pick up at any office supply store. And these have the letters of the alphabet on there. But what I do is I take them, I flip it, and then the back side is blank. And I use a fine tip uh, Sharpie pen. And these are, what I, these are the categories I give it. So one of them says daily. And then the next five have Monday through Friday. And after that, I use 30 of them and write the day of the, the, day of the month, one through 30. So it will, take, uh, it will take two packs of these to, um, to get that done. Next, I begin taking verses that um, maybe I've already started memorizing, but I write them down on a card or um, verses I hear in a sermon or in a Bible study or just simply reading his word and a verse sticks out and I want to uh, bring that to memory. I write the verse down on a 4 by 6 card and I file it in the daily tab. And I review that every single day. And once I feel like I have it to memory, then it moves to the weekly tab. So the first one will go into Monday. The second one will go into Tuesday. So then I'm re reviewing my verse in the daily tab. And then I'm also reviewing the verse that day of the week. So today being Wednesday, I would review the verses I have in the Wednesday tab. Then after I feel like I've got it to memory weekly and I feel like I know the verse well, then it goes into the monthly tab. So I'm only reviewing that verse once a month. And slowly and surely the um, memory system box begins to fill up. And so every day I am going over a daily verse, a weekly verse, and then a monthly verse. For this to be a discipline, um, the scripture memory system, I always take it with me when I travel. And it's really easy. Uh, and again, it's very homemade. So I take a, um, a clip and if I know that I'm going to be gone Monday through Wednesday, I'll take the Monday through Wednesday tabs. And let's say the Monday through Wednesday fall on the 12th through the 14th of the month. So I'll take those tabs and verses out as well. I clip them together, and then I put them inside a Ziploc bag to travel with. And even if this is the only thing, maybe I'm having to travel light, I at least have his word with me, and I'm going over verses every single day. Um, so, it, yeah, very easy to travel with. And then I know um, just how life can be, and it could be that um, maybe your, your quiet times are limited or you've got young kids or um, just the circumstances that life has. Um, for you right now, maybe limit the time that you can sit and do Bible study. The beautiful thing about the Scripture Memory System is that it can be by your bedside, and it's something that you do the first 10 minutes of the morning or the last 10 minutes of the day. It can sit in your kitchen uh, by your sink, and you're recalling those verses as you're preparing dinner or something that you keep uh, in your laundry room and go over those verses as you're folding clothes. Uh, he promises that his word does not return void. And so I challenge you and encourage you that you can do this. I'm a slow memorizer, and it takes me a while to bring a scripture to memory. But God is so good and so faithful that when we do hide his word in our heart, that throughout the day and in certain um, circumstances, that he will bring to mind those verses that we have, we have hidden in our heart. So blessings as you start your scripture memory system.